everyone, it's Robin here, and today we're gonna be opening some Disney pin mail and a little bit of magic mail too, which I'm really excited about. So in our mail today, we have a few pin trades here. Ah, so much fun, right? I have a purchase that I'm very excited about, and I have a piece of magic mail that showed up at my doorstep. Isn't it beautiful? Look at this envelope. It's from my friend Kate. You know her as Princess Minnie, and she is fabulous. Now, when this showed up at my door, my first thought was, uh-oh, did we have a swap or a trade in the works that I completely forgot about? So, of course, I messaged her, and she just sent me something because she is fabulous that way, and I'm super excited to get into it. So, let's open this up. So, Kate has an awesome, awesome channel. i um, been watching her since the beginning of my channel, that's for sure, even beforehand. She influenced a lot of what I do on my channel, and if you haven't seen her, you need to go watch her. She does a ton of great Disney content. Uh, she does a lot with pins and some hauls and she also does uh, park vlogs when she's in the parks which is really fun. So what have we got in here? Wow! What is this? So it says, Robin, hope you have fun with this and oh, look at the button on here. That's so cute. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Let me show you this check out this awesome button. Now I know Kate is a huge fan of buttons, so getting a button from her certainly doesn't surprise me, but look at how awesome this is. It has a tiki bird, which is so my love, right? Now this design is very familiar. I just shared some pins. I'm pretty sure this comes from the small shop, Alicia's Wonderland, because she has a pin design coming out in this D. It's the Disneyland D with the tiki birds, and it's amazing. So cute. I'm gonna wear this. You think I can wear this? Oh yeah, totally. I'm gonna put it right here. Ah, super cute. Thank you, Kate. That's nice. And here is what she sent. Hope you have fun with this. Oh, that's fun. It's a diorama and it's of the Tiki Room. It's a Tiki Room diorama. Oh my gosh, these are so much fun. Let me um, give you a close look at this. So here's the completed picture of the diorama. So it's the Tiki Room and oh my gosh, this is super cool. So there's six sections and it makes levels and you can see them in here. Look at that. That's pretty awesome. Let's do this. So they come on these boards that you pop the pieces out and then you connect them all together. <gasps> That's gonna be fun. I am totally putting this together. Oh my gosh, this is gonna look awesome. So I punched out all of the windows and they look really cool and you put them together with these little comb pieces. So let's just get this started, right? Because I'm pretty excited to see what this is gonna look like. So let me just put this on the front here and I'm making sure the brown part stays on the outside. And so then we just stick the second piece right behind it. This is gonna look cool. So look where we're at so far. Woohoo! Super fun, super fun. Look at that, that looks cool. Okay, so now we have more comb pieces to put all around to reinforce it. So I'm gonna do that and then we're really gonna take a look at the finished product. Wow, this looks cool. Oh my gosh, that is really cute. Oh my gosh, that is really cute. Let me show you guys up close. I have my own little tiki room in a box. <laughs> that is so adorable. So we have some birds in here and look at all the different levels. It's just beautiful. Love these guys up here too. So you can see how it went together. It's just six pieces and um, those comb-like pieces are what's holding it together. It's very sturdy once it's done, that's for sure. Oh my gosh, this is adorable. I am loving this. Thank you so much, Kate. This was really fun to put together and I absolutely love this. It is definitely making my tiki heart sing for sure. Ah, super cute. So next I have a purchase that I made from a small shop on Etsy, Mickey's Monthly Magic. And I'm pretty excited about this because it's like a monthly pin subscription. But you don't have to do it monthly. You can purchase it on a month to month basis. Now she has quite a few options. Her prices are very reasonable. And I got very intrigued because this one is the custom pin pack, which I was very excited for. It was $20. You get two to three authentic Disney pins, but it's customized. So she had a drop-down menu. So if you have a favorite character, say 
you just absolutely love Pluto and you want all Pluto pins, you can tell her that and your pack will include Pluto pins or attraction pins. She has a drop down of some options and the option that caught my eye was Disneyland Paris pins. What? Two to three authentic Disneyland Paris pins for $20 as a mystery sounded like a fun thing to me. So that's what we have here. So let's just see what we have going on in this one, okay? Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Now I love the Paris pins. I don't live anywhere near Paris. <laughs> I don't really live near the parks anyway, so any of the pins would have been fine. But um, I do like the Paris pins, and I don't get a, a, a really a lot of chance to get Paris pins, so this is really exciting. So, okay, so we have one pack here, but it's okay, it's a booster pack, which does give you quantity pins. Oh, it's awesome too. It's the Little Mermaid booster pack from Paris. This is an awesome pack. I will say I do already have this booster pack, but that's fine with me because these could make great traders uh, because they are awesome, awesome pins. Definitely worth the price I paid for it. Let me take them out of the packaging and give you guys a close up. So here you can see them all on the card here and we have King Triton and we have Ariel in her mermaid form, Prince Eric and Max, which is really nice. These are a good size pins. Now I do know uh, when Box Lunch released their Little Mermaid set, some of the pins in there looked similar to these, but they were a lot smaller. So if you got a King Triton, or I think even the Max, and maybe even Ariel, they're very similar to the pins on this booster pack, but um, a lot smaller. So these are really nice pins. I'm gonna take them off the card and give you a real good close up. First we have King Triton, and you know, if you're gonna have a Little Mermaid collection, you definitely need a King Triton pin. He looks magnificent in this pin, doesn't he? Wow. So these pins um, do have one pin post. They are a silver backing and they are Disneyland Paris, and they are very, very nice weighty pins. Love this. Next we have Ariel, and she's in her mermaid form, and look at her fin down here, it's so pretty. I love the movement of her fin there. Her hair is looking exceptionally nice too. It has that floating element, like she's floating in the water. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. Look at her. And we have Prince Eric here, and what I love about this pin too is that he is next to Max, and it's they're playing together. So I think that storytelling is really nice. And look how awesome Max is running around. Oh my gosh, so much fun. So much fun. So getting this booster set was pretty awesome in the Mickey's Monthly Magic. Um, I'm pretty happy I paid $20 and I got four pins. Um, she promises again two to three in the custom set. Um, but I, again, I will leave the information down below for you so you can go check her out and see if there's anything in there that you're interested in. But I'm pretty happy with these pins. So next we have some pin trades because we had a pin trading days on my Facebook group, Oh Hello Robin, Disney Pins and More. And I did so many trades and Rod Hat was there with his doubles hat and he did so many trades. And these are some of the trades that I had made that I wanna share with you guys today. And the first one comes from Alicia and Alicia is in Florida. Hi Alicia, I'm pretty excited to open your envelope. So, oh wow, there's some stuff in here. I'm pretty excited. Um, here's a note. Let me grab the note first. It says, Robin, um, thank you for the trade and for creating such a fun group. Thank you, Alicia. You know, you guys are all making the group very fun, that's for sure. I hope you enjoy the little mystery. Oh my God. I'm going to because I kind of caught a glimpse of it. Uh, okay. It's one of the wishables. I have not opened any of these. Okay, well let's get to the pin trade first and then we'll get to the wishables. So, um, oh my gosh, I remember this. Oh wow, this is fun. Okay, so <laughs> she put it on a fast pass. Oh my gosh. So on Tuesday, June 18th, I could have gone on Star Tours with a fast pass. I love this pin with all the Mickey faces. Oh my gosh, let me show you guys. Look how cute this pin is. Look at how many faces. What is that? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight faces. I count. Did you count others? Maybe I'm missing one. <laughs> I love a Mickey. Well, I love Mickey anyway, right? But um, I love Mickey in black and white form. I love Mickey and Minnie together in black and white form. And I kind of have a little bit of collection like that going. So this can definitely uh, go with that and, and, and a few other collections for sure. But this pin is adorable. But check this fast pass out for Star Tours at 10.40 to 11.40. Oh my gosh, that would have been fun on Tuesday, 
June 18th. <laughs> I love having this fast pass. Super fun. I'm definitely keeping a hold of this for sure. Thank you for putting it on there, Alicia. Look at this Wishables. Now, Wishables is a is relatively new. They've been doing it for a few months now at Disney, and they're uh, squishy little plushes in here. And this one uh, definitely is the Nemo pack for sure. Oh my gosh, it's it's just so squishy. It's very cute. And um, there's four different options you can get: Dory, Bruce, a Nemo submarine, or Darla. So here we have Bruce the shark up here, and we have Darla swimming around. And of course we have Dory and the submarine. And you can see on the back it shows you all of the plushies. And I know Darla's name because it tells me that there. <laughs> this is really cute. So it contains one of four. What would I want? I don't know. Dory's cute. I like the sh I like Bruce the shark would be fun too. The uh, ride vehicle is always fun. I don't know. We're gonna just rip it open and see. I'm excited. I've been wanting to open these. I see people open them. Okay, it's very plushy. It's very cute. Feels very round. It's a submarine. It's the ride vehicle. Okay, actually, this is adorable. It's so soft too. Oh, so cute, and it is very squishable. Oh yeah, it has that give and release to it, kind of like uh, you know those stress balls. <laughs> this will be really cute. Let me show you. Look at this ride vehicle. Oh my gosh, got my own submarine now, man. Look at that. Oh, there's this propeller. <laughs> so cute. So cute. And squishable. <laughs> I love this. Alicia, thank you so much. Love my trade and love that extra. Always love a bit of a mystery too. I have a box here. And this box comes from Heather and Heather's in Georgia. So let's see what we have in here. Okay, there is a lot happening in here too. Look at, there's some fun confettis. I see you right on the top. Look at the Mickey confettis. Super cute. I see a card here. Let's go to that. Monsters Inc. Love Monsters Inc. And love me some Sully, that's for sure. And it says, Dear Robin, thanks so much for the trade. Love watching all your videos. Thank you very much, Heather. I really do appreciate that. They always brighten my day and are a great break in a hectic day. Blessings to you and your family. Heather, thank you so much. That's very, very sweet. Um, there's, a, there's some things happening in here. Look, there's some pins and some extras. So let me, um, here, let me look. See? Ah, and there's another one. There we go. Oh! All the confetti. Super fun, right? Okay, so let's get to the pins first. So here's the two pins that we traded for. I'm on this hair bow kick, the princess hair bows from Box Lunch. Oh my gosh, and here we have Tiana. Isn't she gorgeous? Um, ah, such a beautiful, beautiful pin. And then the second pin I have, and I'll show you this up close in just a second, is Miko, a hidden Mickey. I love hidden Mickey pins, and Miko is adorable. Let me show you both of these pins. This Tiana hair bow is one of my favorites in the whole collection. It's so beautiful. Well, Tiana has the most beautiful dress, um, in my book at least. I love her green dress, it's so pretty. What I love about this, it has like this little pad thing going on, but the bottom of the bow, it looks like frog legs. <laughs> so cute, love this bow. And look at how awesome Miko is. And I just adore hidden Mickey pens. Love the hidden Mickey pens. They're just so much fun. So I'm always looking for those on trader boards for sure. Super cute. And there's two packages here too. So what is this? Little surprises, always fun. Uh, oh, it's so cute. It's a keychain. It's a cat. Is that Berlioz? I think that's Berlioz. Do I have that right? The Aristocat. Oh my gosh, he's adorable. Look at him. I think Berlioz is the gray cat. Let me show you up close. Look at him. He's adorable. These keychains are really nice. You can hang them on your keys or you can hang them on your backpacks. You can hang them on your pin boards. You can hang them on a lot of things. Use them as luggage tags. <laughs> Well, I mean, it couldn't be the tag, but you know, to help identify it. <laughs> He's really cute. Love the Aristocats. Super cute. And there's one more. Ah! Oh, talk about Wishables. Look, it's Br'er Rabbit. Oh my gosh, he's adorable. He's soft like he's soft like the submarine. <laughs> he's super cute. Oh my gosh, I might need to get some more Wishables to open, right? 
I think so, they're really nice. Oh my gosh, he's very soft. Now they have a few different collections, like I just opened the Nemo, they have a Splash Mountain collection, which is really, really cool. Um, they have a they had a Pirates of the Caribbean one too, and I think they also had uh, a Disney Snacks. I'm not sure of all the ones they have right now, but I think this is the most recent one maybe? I'm not sure, but I'm like, that is adorable. Let me show you. Oh my gosh, look how cute Br'er Rabbit is from Splash Mountain. I love Splash Mountain too. That is such a great attraction. Oh, look at his little bunny tail. <laughs> so cute. It's such a great attraction. And um, look at his feet. Ah, definitely a family favorite when we go, that's for sure. This is super cute. Heather, thank you so much uh, for the great trade and for these extras. I love them, love them. So our next trade comes from Yvonne and Yvonne's in Florida too. So hi Yvonne, how are you doing there in Florida these days? So let's see if I have a card here. Here's a note right here. Oh, there's, oh my gosh, there's all kinds of cute things coming out. So here we have a note and it says, Robin, I hope you enjoy your pen enclosed are a few goodies I thought you would enjoy. Um, I made the decals just for you. Yvonne, Yvonne, thank you so much. Oh my gosh, I'm excited to see these for sure. I'm excited for sure. Oh my gosh, those are so cute. Okay, okay, okay. Well, let me get down to the pen first. <laughs> Let's see. Okay, oh wait, there's more coming out. Oh, super cute. Cute, okay. So um, let me get to this pin for the pin trade first. Oh, here we go again. It's another hair bow. I'm trying to complete that collection of hair bows and um, I've opened quite a few boxes. I'm almost, I'm almost complete, almost complete. Let's see which one we have here. Oh, we have Belle. Oh my gosh, it's so beautiful. Belle's bow is beautiful. It looks, again, like a lot of them, just like her dress. But I love the detail of the draping of her dress in here with the red rose and so much sparkle. Let me show you up close. So again, these bows come from the box lunch collection and this is Belle. And look at that draping on there for her dress. Isn't this a beautiful bow? Oh, I don't know. This one might be the most beautiful one now, right? <laughs> the red rose there, and I love the sparkle they put in this section of it. Super beautiful. Yvonne also included some really cute Cinderella stickers, which is a very good hint at the decals that she created. I can't believe these. You created these. These are beautiful. It is the mice from Cinderella. We have Jacques and we have Gus Gus. Aren't they really pretty? So um, I don't know, Did you created these. Do you have a shop? Um, I will find that out and link that down below for you guys when I do. Um, this says, uh, let's get personal LGP and there's a phone number there. Um, but these decals are gorgeous. Let me take them out of the packaging to show you guys. Look at these lovely decals of Jacques and Gus Gus. Oh my gosh, I love the mice in Cinderella. I love all of the animals in Cinderella. My favorite part of that, then it really includes them, is when they're help, helping her make that pink dress. I love that, I love that part so much. These two are so much fun. These are beautifully done. I cannot wait to uh, use them, figure out what I will put these decals on for sure. So adorable. Thank you so much, Yvonne. These are beautiful. And um, I need to find out if you have a shop or something because I definitely want to link it down below in case anybody wants to check it out. So we'll find that out and do that for you. Um, but thank you so much. I really, I really love these. I appreciate them. Oh my gosh, they're so cute. Okay, we have one more trade here. And this trade comes from Zara. And Zara's in Wisconsin. And uh, there's a beautiful bell sticker here. So let's see what we have in this one. Okay, I see our trade here. And there's a note. And it says, thanks for the trade. Hope you can complete your set soon. Zara. Oh my gosh, it's another hair bow. That's right, I pulled these because of the hair bows. You know, I'm gonna have to check because we might, we might be complete. So again, I'm on a hair bow kick. <laughs> Love the princess hair bows. I think I love that box set so much because they include all of the official Disney princesses, which a lot of the mystery sets don't. You always miss one or two. You know, Pocahontas and Meredith always gets left off of those for sure. But we have the Mulan bow. It is gorgeous. This pin is really pretty. There is 
color and sparkle going on. This bow is beautiful. Let me show you. This is a beautiful hair bow, that is for sure. There are a lot of different colors. I love, you know, the pinks with the reds and the purples and the blues. <laughs> so pretty, I just basically named all the colors. And the greens and the whites, how's that? I name all the colors. I think there's yellow in there too. <laughs> The sparkle is really nice on here. Um, this bow is really pretty. Uh, very reminiscent of her um, matchmaker outfit. I think that's what it's after, her matchmaker outfit for sure. So colorful and so beautiful. You know what, Zara? Here we go. Ah, there we have it. Look at that. Oh my gosh, these bows are fabulous. So there are 11 official Disney princesses, although I think they need to make Moana a princess, but maybe that's, that's a whole other story. But there are 11 official Disney princesses and I have 11 of their bows. Look at this. So I have the Rapunzel and Ariel and Jasmine, Cinderella, Pocahontas, Aurora, Tiana, Snow White, Merida, Belle, and Mulan. Oh my gosh. Now the box lunch set does have one more pin in it because there's 12 in the collection. It's the chaser pin. It's Maleficent. So how many boxes do I need to get to get Maleficent, right? <laughs> I would like to get that though, but I am pretty satisfied to have this complete set for sure. So this was a fun pin mail with a lot of extra magic mail sprinkled in and I'm pretty excited about that. And I want to thank Zara and Heather and Yvonne and Alicia for all of the awesome some trades that's for sure now if you enjoy pin trading because I'm telling you pin trading is fun I'm on my Facebook group oh hello Robin Disney pins and more we're primarily a Disney discussion and sharing group but every now and then we have pin trading days and we are having pin trading days this upcoming weekend while everybody else is in Walt Disney World at the fairy tales event we'll be doing a pin trading event of our own on the Facebook page so go check it out and uh, get involved with some really nice people and have a good time pin trading that's for sure um, I also want to thank Kate thank you so much for my tiki room in a box. I love this. You know I do. You know I love this. <laughs> now the birds can sing words on my desk. <laughs> anyway, I feel so blessed to have so many awesome friends. Thank you all for joining me. Let me know if we're pin twins on anything or if you've opened any of the wishables. Which ones have you opened? Because I'm a little interested in them now, right? <laughs> I hope you all are having a magical day and I will see you in my next video. Bye.